Hi dear students, I am Dr. Mashur. Welcome to my class. Today I would like to discuss introduction to biotechnology. First we can see what is biotechnology. The term biotechnology is defined as the, is the application of scientific and engineering principles to use, improve or modify biological system fully or partially for industry or for human welfare. United States Congress Office of Technology Assessment defined biotechnology as any technique that is used in living organism to make or modify a product, to improve a plant or animal or to develop a microorganism for specific uses. And the term biotechnology is coined by an Hungarian agricultural engineer Karl Erke in, in 1919. Biotechnology is a one of emerging field of science which has a major role in life. We can see the application of biotechnology from ancient time. In BC 6000, the men were started to make beer and wine and they were also started to prepare yogurt. From history we can see in BC uh, 4000 onwards, the men were started to make bread and curd. But they was don't know the science behind the fermentation. Louis Pasteur is the scientist. He identified the role of microorganism in fermentation. That's why most of the renowned scientists called Louis Pasteur as a father of biotechnology. Now we can see the different areas of biotechnology. The biotechnology were applied in medical field. That is known as medical biotechnology. And we can see the application of biotechnology in agriculture that is known as agriculture biotechnology and uh, application in food that is known as food biotechnology and ap application in industry that is known as industrial biotechnology and application in environment that is known as environmental biotechnology and we can also see the application of biotechnology in marine that is known as marine biotechnology and uh, in uh, almost every field we can see the application of biotechnology we can see the application of biotechnology in each area in detail. First we can see the application of biotechnology in the medical field. One is stem cell therapy. This is also known as regenerative medicine. In stem cell therapy, the defective or injured or dysfunctional cells were repaired through these stem cells. Next is antibody therapy. In this antibody therapy, monoclonal antibodies were used to treat diseases like cancer and other virus disease causing diseases. Another one application is gene therapy. In gene therapy, the defective genes were replaced by unaltered genes. Pharmaceuticals like antibiotics and other medicines were also synthesized using this biotechnology. Another one application is human genome project. The data obtained from the human genome project, we can analyze the disease causing genes present in the human genome. In recommended pharmaceuticals, using recommended DNA technology, science were developed recommended vaccines and recommend human insulin like products. Another application is tissue engineering. Using this tissue engineering scientists were developed artificial skins and they were also trying to do organ cloning. One of the major application is biotechnology is for disease diagnosis. For example, for detecting COVID-19 we are using real-time PCR. Next we can see the application of agricultural biotechnology. Using genetic engineering, we can create transient plants like Bt cotton, Bt brinjal. These crops can able to increase the productivity of this plant because these plants are safe from pests. Using genetic engineering, the shelf life of a fruit can be increased 
flavor soy to tomato is one of the example of such fruit using plant biotechnology we can increase the nutritional value of a food crop golden rice is an example of such crop it having high content of vitamin a using plant biotechnology we can create drought tolerant salt tolerant and frost tolerant plants that's why this plant can able to cultivate in irrespective of season and geography one of the major application of plant biotechnology is that we can create thousands of plants with a short time using plant tissue culture and the application of biotechnology in food there is a food biotechnology using biotechnology we can increase the production of food by cultivating pest resistant plant and it also helps to give safe food by that will be free from pesticides biotechnology also helps to develop therapeutic foods like therapeutic milk that will helps to control some certain diseases some of the application listed here were explain in the part of agricultural biotechnology next the industrial biotechnology and in industrial biotechnology biotechnology were applied to produce enzymes that is industrially important enzyme and this biotechnology also used for synthesizing biofuels like ethanol biogas etc and biotechnology also used to synthesize bio detergents and biotechnology also having a role in food industry for soft food soft drinks development and it also having role in beverage industry and this biotechnology having a role in paper industry and it has a major role in leather industry and uh, some other industries also biotechnology having major roles next we can see environmental biotechnology the what are the applications of biotechnology in the environment the main aim of environmental biotechnology is to protect the environment and make the environment pollution free and the water will be contamination free and the atmosphere is free of toxic gases and biotechnology has a major role in waste management especially in wastewater treatment bioremediation is the one of application of biotechnology in which the plants and microbes were used to remove toxic chemicals from the environment metagenomics is the recent application of biotechnology in environment using this metagenomics we can identify the total microbes present in a specific area next is the blue biotechnology or marine biotechnology marine or blue biotechnology refers to the exploitation of sea resources to create new products the fundamental principle behind the marine biotechnology is the biomolecules produced by marine organism may have a novel character or property compared to the terrestrial organisms one of fluorescent protein isolated from jellyfish that is used as a molecular marker in recombinant dna technology and this fluorescent protein coding genes were inserted into fish and created transgenic glowfish another one of the important application is for the pcr we are using tag dna polymerase and this enzyme is isolated from the tag thermus aquaticus bacteria is related from hot springs from this we have learned that biotechnology has a major role in almost every field of life i hope you understood this class thank you thank you for the listening